You heard Denny praying for the cans. I'd like to invite uh, Zach and Cassidy. You have Jude and Oliver with you. Um, and uh, come on up to the front. I'd like to invite any of the elders uh, that are in the room to come up to the front as well. We're going to surround them. And Scott Maxwell, I see you, um, executive director with Finisteer. Uh, would you come up as well? I didn't warn you. Sorry. Thank you. Um, and uh, this is a, a sad, happy day. Okay, if you guys sort of get close here, inner circle. And now I'm going to ask all of you to stand up and make your way forward. <laughs> and we're going to have a group prayer hug for the cans. This is their last Sunday. Don't be shy. Come on down the aisles. We're going to dismiss and greet each other in a minute anyway. So this is a good time to get out of your seats. Just come down and get close. So the cans have tickets to depart on Friday this week to make their way back to Papua New Guinea. You heard Denny uh, pray about an earthquake, got a note from Jeremy this morning. There were 11 earthquakes in a span of 12 hours yesterday. Um, and, and we know that earthquakes can't stop the gospel. We know that enemies can't interfere with the purchase of God's redeemed from every nation and tongue and tribe and people. Um, but we also know that the means of Jesus getting those for whom he laid down his life is people with beautiful feet going, taking the good news, proclaiming. It means churches sending. And this is costly. Uh, Zach, Cassidy, it's hard to see you go. And go, you must, if the lamb is to receive the reward of his suffering. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we send our friends back to where it's hard, to where the work is seemingly endless, to where hearts are hard, to where people are spiritually dead. To, to a place where the barriers for proclamation of the gospel are immense. Geographical, topographical, linguistic, cultural. We know that you can and we know that you will overcome all of these things. Because Lord Jesus, you are worthy. Because you were slain and you purchased for God with your blood people from every tongue and tribe and people and nation. And you have made them to be a kingdom and priests to our God. And they will reign upon the earth. This is guaranteed. Sealed by your blood. And also guaranteed by your providential hand. In raising up and equipping and sending our friends to the ends of the earth. Lord Jesus, would you be pleased to receive the reward of your suffering? It's in your name we pray. Amen.